Hey, what's going on guys? It is Lasty here and welcome to yet another live pack opening. We have a new team of the week, or it's been out for a few days now, but, you know, I haven't done a pack opening on it yet. We've got a really, really sick team of the week this week. Just look at look at your screen right now. It is pretty awesome. Uh, if you guys are looking to buy coins so that you can have some of these players, be sure to check out FIFA Coin Traders. They're going to offer you a fast and reliable service for you guys and their links will be in the description below. But let's just have a look at this team. I mean, we have got Inform Hugo Lloris. I mean, 92 diving, 92 reflexes, 87 handling and positioning. That is an incredible goalkeeper right there. We've got an Inform Leighton Baines, whose stats look overall really, really awesome. Uh, we have got Inform Bastion, who looks godly as well. My god, I want to pull him. Farfan, wow, he's rapid. I didn't know he was quite that quick. 91 pace, Jesus. And who else? We've got Higuain, who is, you know, I've, you may have seen my video on Higuain, and he was uh, pretty decent from what I've used of him so far. And uh, then the big man, Sami Etu, he's a tanky player as well, 91 pace, 85 shooting, that's a sick card. Um, so that is a really, really sick team of the week. Also on the bench, you've got Inform Puki, who, if you used him last year, uh, that's a plus one from me because he was he was an awesome card last year. Uh, right, let's just get into some of this uh, store. Go buy some gold packs, shall we? Let's see how let's see how we can do with our luck today. I'm going to do a few nose packs as well, just because obviously you know they're lucky. Frey, not not a great start. We don't normally have a great start though, so uh, you know have, how full is my we're coming up. I'm going to keep these contracts and stuff. Apologies if I spend a bit too much time just keeping all of this stuff because I'm just going to sell it in the um, in the trade pile because when I'm recording this, we're coming up for the, the weekend and also you guys that go to school, you're, you're all off for the next couple of weeks. So a lot of you are going to be playing Ultimate Team, which means consumable prices will rise. So there's a little tip for you guys. You know, If you're going to get some... Uh, some consumables in your packs make sure you keep them and try and sell them on because it's going to be more of you guys playing than normal um, like right here I'll keep the non rare contracts because on the weekends they sell for about 300 coins which is pretty good uh, I tend to keep the fitness and the squad morale because I always use them uh, and then I'm gonna keep that kit because that looks cool oh so does that one and we will I'm going to sell the buying badge. People are going to want it. So you can you can make the most of your money from these packs. Like I'm sure if you get one half decent player, you can almost make your money back. Give me a good player. Come on. No, not good. What is with my luck on this game? But I hope you guys... I, I plan on uploading this on Tuesday night. So I hope you guys are actually enjoying your um, Easter break. Or you had a good four days off if you live in the UK, I think. I'm not sure what you guys from different countries, if you had any days off for Easter or anything. Um, but we did, and I'm back at work now, but I had a nice few days off. Made the most of it to make a lot of videos for you guys, because I know that a lot of you school kids are off for two weeks, so I want to try my hand at uploading every day for two weeks, uh, with a double upload on Saturday, which for me is a hell of a lot of effort, because obviously I work all the time. Um, but I just I really wanted to see how my channel would do if if I uploaded daily. Like I wanted to see, you know, whether my channel would grow because of that, or whether my views would like dwindle and go down and that sort of thing. So it's like an experiment for me to just see how we'd do, you know, as a team, us lot, you know, how how would we do? So uh, yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed your little Easter break and stuff and. Do you guys like Easter eggs? I love Easter eggs. It, for some reason, it makes chocolate taste better. Um, if you if you can understand where I'm coming from there, then let me know. Because uh, I think for some reason, Easter egg chocolate is just amazing. Uh, and you can't beat a good cream egg either. I love cream eggs. Uh, discard the Arsenal badge, lol. Um, sorry, Piers Morgan, if you're watching this video, which I highly doubt. Oh, who's this going to be? Rodolfo. Why why would you troll me and say you got a rare player and then give me that shit? EA. Uh, Matip's a good player, but he doesn't sell for anything really. I've just used him as well. Um, but yeah, so I hope you've all enjoyed and enjoyed some Easter eggs and stuff. 
And one one topic that I actually wanted to talk to you guys about was what is it that you guys enjoy about watching people open packs? Um, because I don't particularly enjoy it. And for me, like a pack opening video, like a live video like this, is probably the easiest video I could do across, you know, all of the range of videos I do. Oh, Dost. Oh, they're trolling me again. They keep telling me about rare gold players and then they're trolling me. Um, but yeah, like this is the easiest kind of video for me, and I sort of feel guilty sometimes because it doesn't take an awful lot of effort. Um, but for some reason, you guys really like to watch pack openings and see what people get. Is it is it just because of that? Like, do you guys not buy many packs yourselves, and therefore you sort of you want to live the pack opening life through other people on YouTube? Let me know in the comments. That'd be an interesting one. Um, because I don't expect all of you to sort of watch these videos just because not everyone does like pack openings but then there's a lot of you who absolutely love them and tweet me about them all the time you know lastly please can you bring out a pack opening I can feed myself uh, nine galan's good but he doesn't sell unless he's in a good formation uh, he might sell put him in a tray pile um, so yeah you know let me know I'd like to know that from you guys um, I had another topic to talk about as well, which was based around video content from me. That was it. I've got it now. Would you guys ever be interested in seeing a career mode series from me? Personally, it's not something I'm that interested in doing. But I've had a few tweets and private messages and stuff from you lads saying would love that. And again, I think career mode is sort of like a really easy way about going to make some videos sometimes because like all you do is record for a couple of hours and then you've got like eight videos ready whereas a squad builder takes a bit more sort of effort than that like because you need to go ahead and go out and get your clips and stuff that's a nice badge I'm gonna keep that and that's a nice kit I'm gonna keep that um, but yeah so would that ever be anything you're interested in and if so would you be looking for a sort of one where we go from rags to riches almost. Um, Gutsa, yeah, good player. Do like a bit of Mario Gutsa. Put him in the trade pile. He'll sell for about 1,000 coins, which is awesome. Now, um, so yeah, let me know. Would you like, if I did ever decide to do it, it might be something I'm not really even interested in. But uh, if it gets enough sort of want from you guys, then sure, I'll give it a go. Would it be like a rags to riches kind of thing you're interested in? Or would you be looking more for um, like me just to be like Barcelona or Man City and then buy this sick team right off the start and just get things moving straight away? So that's something I'd also kind of like to know if, if you guys are still actually watching <laughs> and uh, listening to me and willing to leave a comment. That would be amazing. Um, wow, that guy looks all right. What league does he play in? He plays in the MLS. I might have to try him out at some point. He looks like an alright card. Um, so yeah, let me know about that as well. And also, I'm doing budget builders in the near future. So you've seen one yesterday. If, if all has gone to plan, you will have seen one yesterday anyway. Um, and then from then on, I have got... So yesterday was a 20k budget. Uh, I've also got planned a 50k, a 100k, and then something like a 350k uh, budget. So it sort of offers all the different various things that I've seen in the comments. Usufa, good player, really good player. Got him in my club already, I believe. Yes. Um, so I would be very interested to see your thoughts on whether or not you think... Um, those budgets sound all right. Whether there's anything else I can I can do. Oh, I'm gonna have to get rid of these contracts and stuff. Wait, let's have a quick look in the consumables. Ah, you know what? It's gonna have to be it. I'm afraid, lads. What we're gonna do is just discard, unfortunately, um, because yeah, we're done. I'm pretty sure we've opened a few packs. Ah, oh, let's go for one more. We're gonna have to discard it all, no matter what. But. <laughs> Yannick doesn't sound good to me right guys well let me know all that stuff in the comments if you are still watching um, I do appreciate you guys for watching and I'd love to see maybe 700 likes on this video if you can do that that would be immense and I'll see you guys tomorrow peace